So how much have you learned? Get ready for a quiz. So take out a pen or a pencil and a piece of paper. There are five questions and four answers per question. I hope you studied enough because they're really hard. Good luck. One. Which epithelial tissue is a stratified cuboidal epithelium? A. B. C. Or D. And the answer is, it's B. Gee, I hope you got it right. Cuboidal epithelium is multiple layers, and as you could tell, each cell was cubed. Question 2. Which statement is not true about epithelial tissues? A. Epithelial tissue secretes substances such as enzymes, hormones, and lubricating fluids. B. Because of the thin layers of cells, Epithelial tissue does not provide protection from injury or microbial invasion. C. The thin structure allows and promotes diffusion of gases, liquids, and nutrients. Or D. Aids in waste removing through the kidneys, glands, and the lungs. And the answer is B. Because of thin layers of cells, epithelial tissue does not provide protection from injury or microbial infection. That one's not true because it's not a thin layer, it's a thick multiple layer. Question 3. What are the defining characteristics of transitional epithelial tissues? A. Strayed being made up of two or more layers of cells. B. Layers are seen when constricted and less layers are seen when relaxed. C. Cells can stretch and relax into flat and rounded shaped cells according to the organ's needs. Or D. Both A and B. And the answer is C. Cells can stretch and relax into flat and rounded shaped cells according to the organ's needs. So, such as the cuboidal and or columnar, they shape to what the organ is needs. Question 4. What is true about the anatomy and how it relates to the physiology of pseudostratified columnar epithelium? A. The cilia secrete mucus, which traps dust microorganisms, protecting the lungs from foreign particles. B. The goblet cells, which have a special structure in which they brush away particles, like a broom, preventing them from entering the lungs. C. The unique structure can easily adjust to the movement of the lungs while breathing occurs. Or D, the mucus layer eats particles that enter the nasal cavity. And the answer is C, the unique structure can easily adjust to the movement of the lungs while breathing occurs. Question 5. What is the best definition of stratified squamous cells? A, cells become soft and moist. B, Cells go through the process of keratinization, where it develops a protective covering. C. The cells become rounded as they age. Or D. All of the above. And the answer is C. The cells become rounded as they age. And it looks like that's the end of our quiz. How sad. So, I hope you got all five questions correct. If you didn't, maybe you should go back and review. Good luck!